Welcome back to my channel. My name is Michael and I film seals. This is the seal who lived. You can see that dark line around their neck? That is actually an entanglement scar. This seal was either entangled by plastic or fishing line or some sort of trash and a rescue team had to get it off and save them. These seals will accidentally get the trash around their neck when they're swimming in the water. Then there's no way for them to get it off. Then the trash will slowly cut into their skin and cause them to pass away. So thankfully the seal was rescued. And I just want to say thank you to everyone who picks up trash at the beach or in the ocean. You are helping save these seals. And then I saw this seal investigating a shell on the sand. I've never seen a seal really sniff anything before and I'm not too sure how good their sense of smell is. So it's always cool to see these new behaviors. If you enjoy these types of videos, let me know. I'm kind of new to YouTube, but I do enjoy making them. This seal decided to stuff their face in the sand. I wonder if the warm sand feels good on their nose. When they sat up, they looked like a powdered donut. And here's the moment you've all been waiting for. This seal is about to do the legendary banana pose. It's pretty hard to get a banana pose on video because they do it at such random times. Now on this day, the tide was rising, so when I was filming this seal, it was pretty dry all around them. But as the day went on, the water level kept getting higher. But this seal didn't really mind. Even though the waves were crashing up onto their sleeping area, they stayed in the same spot and kept resting. When the waves would come in, the seal would try to banana pose to avoid getting their dry fur wet. But I think it was too late. They were about 70% wet here. This wave almost knocked them over. And then I saw this silly seal sticking their tongue out. They had a bunch of drool running down their face, so I'm sure they took a nice nap. Then they went back to sleep and stretched their hind flippers. I think it's cool how harbor seals can have a wide variation of coats. It's always important for me to note that these videos were filmed from a safe distance. Thanks for stopping by, and if you want to see seal videos in the future, consider subscribing. I'll see you on the next video.